columns over there. And then the rest of the ingredients, we've got dark soy sauce. And over here, we've got our Thai influences, which is ginger, garlic, chili, and uh, they call them salad onion, onions here. Also, I think you can call them spring onions. So we've got a hot wok here. Very important that the wok is hot, so the cooking process is quick. And what we're going to do now is just put our oil in. I've just got uh, um, normal oil here. So that was olive oil. You can actually just use normal oil. And you'll see because the wok is hot, it's going to sizzle pretty much quickly. So you put that in. Okay. Yeah, it's sizzling away nicely. So what we've got in there, as soon as it hits the pan, you can smell the flavors. We've got ginger, garlic, chili, and spring onion, because it's sizzling away. Now, if you were doing this dish with um, chicken, you would probably start with the chicken first, um, brown it for about five minutes, take it out, and then put these ingredients in. Or whether you're doing steak, uh, same thing, pork, put it in first, brown it so you get it caramelized and then uh, take it out and then put this in but because we're doing fish fish is very delicate so you don't really have to do that there's no real browning process with fish we've got our veg uh, going here and it's been going for about three or four minutes the wok actually wasn't quite hot enough so it's taken a little bit longer but you know if it was hot it would be that much quicker you can always see when it starts to brown you know that it's pretty much ready the garlic browns and the ginger browns so now we're going to add our uh, prawns. These are beautiful prawns from uh, Waitrose. Uh, I think they're king prawns. And I've got the tails and I've already uh, taken off the, um, the shells. And I've also got the heads because I love sucking the heads. A lot of people aren't into that, but I think they've got so much flavor. I love to suck the heads. I like sucking lots of things. Okay, so you can see how quickly it cooks now. Because it's fish, it will take literally two or three minutes. You can see it's already going white. Okay, so what we're going to do now is add our seasoning. Always season, salt and pepper. It just brings out the flavors that are there already. It's like the sunshine. Brings things out. Okay, a little bit more oil. Okay, let's get a close up on that. You can see it's already going beautifully uh, pink, which means it's very close to being done. Okay, now we're going to add our dark soy sauce. Um, I think the dark soy sauce is more for saltiness than the, the, the light soy sauce. But I'm not sure if there's a big difference. So we add our soy sauce. This is uh, for the saltiness. You can hear the heat going there. Okay, now it's pretty much done. So I'm just going to turn the heat off and have a bit of sour. So we've got the saltiness, we've got heat from the chilies. We've got salt in this from the soy sauce. Now I'm going to add some lemon juice. Okay, and now for a little bit of sweetness, which is the honey. So whenever you cook, you must always think of your five elements. It's stuff like salt and pepper seasoning, heat for chili, sweetness, and sourness. Um, so always try and add these elements when you cook. So I'm just adding the honey now. Okay, and that is basically done. Next our plate. Okay, so here you can see the finished product. It's our lovely stir-fried Thai prawns with some beautiful steamed rice.